Hey folks, it's Frithgar here. How you doing? Welcome back to my time at Porsche. Let's get straight outside. Uh, we are going to try to start building up some more of our stuff. Um, at least that's the plan. We, we want to start accumulating more stuff that we've got here. But I also want to try to do a whole load of other quests. Hello, we found something useful in the data disk you brought in yesterday. There's a lot of information. Let's go through and mail the results within two days. Okay. Dear Builder, thank you for exemplary effort in pro discovering product issues in yesterday's inspection. You truly have the skills for top tier Builder. Here's a little something for your time. And a harmonica, six power stones, and two tempering liquids. Thank you very much. Right. Today is Monday, so the very first thing that I want to do is I want to wander up this way. I can't make street lights yet, which is one of the things that we need to do. Lift controls, I can't make the lift controls until I've got the big engine. Which is another thing that I want to do. I need to find the dog. Uh, he's somewhere in the, the, the wastelands. Um, something that I want to do. So I've got lots of things that I need to do. Now, let there be light. I can't let there be light. I don't have the thing for the light. So I'm going to have to leave that for a minute. We've got C grade. What's this one? Dark Zoo's clearly need two hardwood sofa. 492. Just put that one back. Uh, 525 gold and 80. Three trap boxes. What? He went and grabbed one. Five, seven, four. Restaurant, four single seats. You with the big plus on it. Four, nine. What? What's, I don't get what the big plus on it is then. Because that's 80 XP. And that one is 80. It's 61 rep. 58 rep. Oh, wait a minute. 62 rep. 61 rep. Right. Uh, two hardwood sofa anyway. I'll go for that one. Grab that and I'll go and make those. So I want to I wanna find the dog. I need to make the controls. And in order to be able to make the controls though, I've got other things that I'm going to need to do with it. Uh, this could become a problem. This could become a serious problem for us. Right, first up, let's go to you right here, and we want to refuel, confirm, copper bars, I don't have very many of, so craft as many as I can, there's 30 of them, and then into that one right there, take those, uh, refuel, yes, and then this one I'm going to make some charcoal, go all of those, like that, and then you right here, fuel depleted, so do a complete refuel on that one and keep making bronze bars. Confirm. I've got 47 bronze bars now, which is pretty good. So pretty soon I'll be able to stop making bronze bars, I think, or at least take a break from them. Uh, there's a load of timber. Craft, I want more carbon steel bars. 19. Confirm. That's all the charcoal used up that I've already got. So I'm fortunately I'm making more charcoal. Uh, hardwood planks, I've, your inventory is full. Fine. Go to there, sort all. Yes. Wow, that was a lot of sorting. Okay, pick those up. More hardwood planks over there. I've got fertilizer there. I've got a ironwood plank right there. Um, I need to make pulleys and wire and stuff like that, I've been told. Carbon steel, I need pulleys for this. That's lubricant from the abandoned ruins too. Um, copper pipes right there. I need copper wires as well. I've got 45 car. I don't have any pulleys though. Refuel that one. Yeah. And confirm. Make five of those. So I've got no carbon steel left at all. But that's going to start making them. And then you over here. Fiber cloth. And I've got... Let's make a load of those. Craft. Oops. Ten. Confirm. Yeah. All right. That's all of them. You on here. What can I make on here? Marble planks. Steel plates. I can't make any of them. Ironwood plank right there. I've got one. I can make a few more. Uh, composite wooden boards. Tree sap. Ironwood plank. Wooden boards. Hardwood planks. Copper plates and bron bronze plates. I don't have very many of those. You know, I'm going to go with a 
let's use this one to make some stuff that I can't make on the other one for a minute. So I will make three ironwood planks on there. This one here, I will do some bronze plates. Right there. I go for ten of those. That's all my bronze bars used up. And then hardwood, we got plain wooden boards and we got hardwood planks. I'll go with the hardwood planks right there. So I will craft ten of them. Confirm. Get them busy making. Right, there's lots and lots of stuff busy making now. Craft over here. Hardwood sofa times two. I can make or I can make seven and I've got zero I've got zero at the moment. I need cotton, I need fibre cloth, and I need hardwood plank. So I want to make two of those there for the quest that I need. You over here, uh, harvest. Potato fruit, 18. So I could do with putting a bit of fertilizer into this one. So I'll take that one there so that I've got fertilizer. That is potato fruit seed, which I will drop there like that. And I'll go here, apply fertilizer. Apply a bit more fertilizer. That takes us up to nearly full. And then I go to that one and I sow that one in it like that. So that will start growing. Okay, fantastic. Now I can go to here and I can go to sort all. Yes, uh, you right there. Take two of those out and then I'll take those ten with me. And we need to sort some of this other stuff out. Where am I going to be putting all of this stuff? You I don't need to do anything with. You right there, again, nothing there for a minute. That one, I don't think there's anything I want to do there. Next one, animal products, I don't think there is anything there. Finished earth, no, what's this? A wrench from the hazardous ruins. Uh, finished wood, that one can go in there. Those there, well they, they've got to go somewhere. I've got consumable parts right here. Crafters, uh, max stamina plus nine from Mysterious Man. See, I don't know. If, I don't know what I need to do with that one. Some of these bits, I really, I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing with them. Like that one there, wrench. There's a bolt. Need this is a tool for the job. I'll, I'll drop that in there for a minute. I, I, I genuinely don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. And then I've got this extra one here. Those 54, they can go in there. What's this? Triple barrel snake bite. Learn to craft it. Oh, right. That's the learn to craft one. All right, that's fair enough. And then here, this is a, a plant type thing. That one can go there. Uh, I think that's everything. Yep. Right, that's everything. Okay, and now I go to you, and I learn that one. Triple barrel snake bite. What is a triple barrel snake bite? New oh, this is the weapon. Triple the weapon based on old relics that use that's used to attack enemies with venom darts. Be careful not to shoot yourself in the foot. Not recommended by the church. Attack plus 100. Range critical damage plus 50%. Hold the attack key for continued attack from work table. Ah. I can make that. That's attack plus 100. Go for it. I know I've just used up springs and jet tubes and a load of other things that might prove to be handy. Um, is this... I got the sword right there. Oh, I need... Ammo? You never said anything about ammo? I know it says that it shoots darts, but I thought maybe it would be like World of Warcraft and um, would let you just like keep making them. Uh, shoots venom darts. So where do I get venom darts from? Craft. I need venom darts. New. Got new. Uh, tree of claws. Uh, that's what I need to do. I need to make that. So I've got the hardwood planks there. I've also got the bits ready for that one so I can go and do those. Venom. Where do I make venom darts? This is... Uh, hmm. Where do I make venom darts? Sleep mask. Umbrella. 
Right, it appears that I've made something here with a load of valuable items that I possibly will have wanted for somewhere else, and I can't actually do anything with it for a minute, so I'm going to drop that one in there, and we'll just keep that one back, and we'll come to that one later on. Right, uh, there's a quest over there that I can't go and do for a minute. Asse oh, the lift controls. Assemble the lift controls. That was the other bit that I needed to find out about. Assembly index, lift controls... Industrial cutter, blender, fish display, lift controls. Right there. Silicon chip, I've got those. From Hazardous Ruins. Right, industrial. I've got to get an industrial engine. From the Hazardous Ruins. So I've got to go back and fight again in Hazardous Ruins. I've got loads of bandages. I've got bonuses and boosts and stuff like that, which are going to help. They're all great. I need to go Commerce Commission, Dr. Zoo, and then I've also got the papaya thing. That was another one that I needed to turn in up here anyway, or near there, I think. So hopefully we'll be able to do both of them together. It was 10 papaya that I needed. Uh, Dr. Zoo. Where's the, what's this? Uh, I don't know. I want you, what is this, uh, Petra's home. Best if we don't go bursting into people's houses. They may get upset with us. So where's Dr. Zoo? Oh. I need to go on up. Up round the back. Not there. There's Arlo. Right at the top, up here. This is where i got to go. Up here. All the way up here. Uh, no, that's the Civil Corps. Clinic. That's what we're looking for. We're looking for the clinic. Let's go in here. Dr. Zoo's clinic. I'm, I'm pretty sure that... Uh, right, so Phyllis is... Thank you. These will be a big help. Time to get busy. Right. She's going to get busy with the bamboo papaya and also... Hey. The Commerce Commission as well. This is pretty well made. If you ever feel unwell, come to our clinic to get a checkup. Excellent. Right, so we've done the Commerce Commission, and we did the other one. Dr. Zoo? Interact. Do you have a stomachache? No? Oh, that's good. We've been, we've been getting too many of these lately. People really need to boil their water before drinking. Right. Oh, we've um, improved our relationship with him. Not a great deal, but we have improved it a little tiny bit, which is always going to help. Um, horses. No, I don't want the horses. Right, so find the dog. Make Dara a fish stew. We need to go. There was a one that we needed to go. And we need to see uh, the farmer. We need to go up there to the tree farm. We've got Old McDonald's stable. Please collect some materials. Wait, what was that one? Martha's delivery. This one is... Go to Martha and find out why her order was late. Yeah, we did that. But we need to make the fruit tarts. I don't think we can get the McDonald's stable. Hardwood plank times five and iron bar times three actually we're going to do that one first hardwood plank times three that's that's like really easy i've got those uh no sorry hardwood plank times five and the other one times three i can do that i've actually got those bits let's just see what the daily price is today down 76 it's getting lower and lower i've got these bits that i've been counting around that i want to sell i don't want to keep them but it just seems to be dropping further and further and further and never actually going up at all. Hardwood planks and iron bars is what we need. Uh, you there, the charcoal. Refuel. Yeah, and make more charcoal. Oops. Make more charcoal. All of them. There we go. Right, that's better. And then you. And then go refuel. Yeah, confirm. Craft. Make two of them. Yeah, confirm. Yeah, yeah, all good. It's all good. This, this is looking good. Um, refuel that. No, I may as well just go like this. Refuel. Like that. Because that's got days and days and days on that one. Um, right here, hardwood plank. That's a, a useful item. You are, you've still got a little bit of time to go on there. I want to go over here. Finished wood, I want... How many do I want? I want three more of those. Confirm. Like that. So I've got five of those. Uh, no one I want those. I want finished wood, finished earth. Right there. So I want those two to go in. I want those two to go in. I need iron bar. I need five iron bar. No. It's less than that. It's 
three iron bar, wasn't it? Is that the way round it needed to be? Oops. I want to do that. I want to go in here. Map mission. Uh, McDonald's stable five and three. Right, we need to go and repair the stable. So what I've been asking people all of this week, and I'm going to continue asking, is do you want to see more live streams on this channel? Some people do, some people don't. I want to know what you think. If I do do more live streams, uh, something else is going to have to change. Although we could very well have some changes coming to the channel anyway because of other things um, that are going on with the channel. Namely, um, right, repair the stable. Um, my overall views and new subscribers and everything is slowly dropping. My channel is um, like it, it's sort of approaching a dip. Now, this is kind of expected from time to time. Um, but I need to obviously look at why this is happening. Um, looks good as new, almost. Nice one, Builder. Really appreciate it. I can open up my ride rental service again. Right, there's one more mission complete. Now, I need to go and speak to Sophie, but... Well, I don't need to speak to her. Uh, mission. It's the... Yeah, uh, the Haunted Cave. We'll go and do that. Martha's Delivery. Remaining time, two hours. I don't have the fruit tarts, and I don't have the ability to make them, and I can't go and buy them. Put the baby animal into a shed or coop to rape... Wait, what? The calf can be bred in the barn. Oh. Oh, in this barn. Into a shed or coop to raise it. What, this one? Can I go in here? Let's drop you down there a minute. Yeah. Or do I need to make my own barn? Uh, I need to make my own barn. Right, so we can put the calf in a chest for now. Put him on ice. Um, one of the things that seems to be cropping up a lot in my sort of research about why things seeming to be dying off a little bit with my channel is the length of the episodes that I do. It would appear that in order to appeal to as many people as possible, I need to actually do shorter episodes than I do now. And this is something that I'm very, very carefully weighing up. How am I going to go about doing this? What would be the best way to do a shorter episode than I currently do? And, right, oh, this is all the DD stops that are marked out. And can I make any more DD stops at the moment? I know that I've got some stuff for DD stops, but I don't think I've got everything for them. Um, hardwood planks, bronze pipe, I own two. I need two. I own three. I've got fiber cloth. So I can make another one if I want to, and then I'll be able to use it, which would be quite useful. All right, let's do that. Let's get those bronze plates there. That hardwood plank. I will go to the animal's chest right here, and I will put those calves in there for a minute. And... And I will go to you, the assembly station, and I will build that one right there. So, in order to build, Martha's delivery mission has failed. I need to put those on there. Oh, I need to get I need to get quite a lot of things. Finished earth. Get those as well. Can't remember how many of them I need. Um, in order to be able to do what I need to do with my channel in order to be able to keep appealing to people it seems that I need to have slightly shorter episodes than I do now the episodes that I'm doing at the moment appear to be too long to keep most people happy and this is no good I, I, I can't keep making videos that are not appealing to as wide an audience as possible um, and so how do I go about uh, making sure that I am appealing to as wide an audience as possible? Well, one of the things that I think I'm going to need to do is... I'll put that in there. Um, do shorter episodes. Do episodes that end at about the 30-minute mark. Um, or thereabouts. As close to 30 minutes as I can possibly get. If I can have episodes finishing at 30 minutes, it seems that this is the best option. Um, it might not be appealing to everybody. You might not like this idea, but I want you to talk about today um, 
me doing shorter episodes and how you think I should go about doing it. I get very easily distracted and games like this don't work very well to doing like a, a certain length of time um, unless I change the way that I start and finish all of the videos and I've been considering that as well how I could go about doing that. Um, there are different ways that I could approach this. Uh, the the one that I've been thinking about at the uh, you know at the moment the most is recording having like a pre-recorded introduction and outro to every video that I do, um, just you know all, all the usual stuff with um, hey folks and um, when I say goodbye and have that kind of as an extra bit that I just insert into the middle of the gameplay. It literally, I just pop that in and right, there we go. We've had to interrupt this. It's time to go. Um, and that way I will run to exactly 30 minutes. I'm not going to be spending a load of time doing a recap at the beginning or wrapping things up at the end. Literally just carrying on with gameplay. So the actual content I'm covering is not going to be reduced by a huge amount. The only real difference that I see at the moment is that uh, you wouldn't physically have that kind of recap in between episodes. And also, it may appear a little bit disjointed um, when you're catching the episodes for the first time. But if you're watching them in a playlist, I know a lot of people do, it could be an improvement. So this is an idea. Again, I'm, I'm all about ideas at the moment because uh, right now... Um, I'm sort of, I'm, I'm gathering intel from all different, we're in, we're in the consultation phase and we're consulting all over the channel in every single different aspect of the channel that I can think of in order to be able to find out what people think of, um, right, hang on, what's that? Restores 35% max health. That's quite cool. It restores stamina, 10% max stamina, um, and then 15 hit points per second. All right, well, we'll drop in a stamina one in there. And we'll put the smoke meat, that's 25 hit points up there. And we're going to go into the Hazard's Ruins again. And we'll see if we can find what's going on in here. Maybe, just maybe, we can find the dog. And maybe we can also find this industrial engine that we need to be looking for in here. So, uh, floor number one. These are going to be tougher to kill. Definitely going to be tougher to kill. Which is going to be tougher on me. Uh, level 20. Actually, it's not too bad. Uh, copper wire, spring. Immediately, copper wire, spring, wrench. Okay, I'm already getting some cool stuff. Cool stuff is good. I like cool stuff. And if I had that gun, that would be good. But I need to be able to shoot stuff, and I don't have any bullets. So that's another thing that I want to be able to work on. Right, well, that first level, that, that was simple enough. I'll just keep going. Um... And also the, the whole live stream thing. Do you want me to do more live streams? Do you not want me to do more live streams? Is this something you think is an excellent idea? Do you really hate the idea of me attempting to do more live streams? Um, do you not like them at all anyway? Um, do you love live streams? Are, are they something that you particularly go for as often as you can? Um, I need to... I need to and would really like to hear all the different feedbacks that you may have on this. Um, because it, it does matter, right? It does matter. Every opinion matters. And in order to properly be able to make an informed decision, I do need to see and read and hear what everybody thinks about this. I cannot sort of make all the decisions that I want to make in order to improve the channel the best possible way for everybody, including myself, it must be said, right? I do have to also take into account what's best for me and what works well for my family. But just because one thing works well for my family doesn't mean I can't do other things as well, right? It's, it's not all... Wait, why aren't I... Do I need to... Break this open with an axe? Oh. It would appear that this is just decoration. I thought maybe it was something else, but it, it seems to be just decoration. Yeah. Okay, I don't, I don't really know what that bit is there. Um, and then continue on. Right. Um, so, yeah. In the comment section, please talk about what I've talked about. Uh, give me your opinions. Do you like any of the ideas? Do you hate the ideas? Um, honestly, at the moment... 
anything could happen because it's I'm, I'm still trying to decide what would be best for the channel as a whole and um, how it could all go forward so I'm getting views and I'm getting opinions from lots of different people and this is absolutely fantastic a lot of people are contributing to this and I want you to continue to do so and if you haven't yet put up an, an you know a, like haven't talked about it yet then please do so get into the comment section talk about it discuss why you think that this is a good idea discuss why you think it's a bad idea and um, i've had all sorts of different opinions coming in so far and i want more of them if you haven't yet spoken if you haven't yet said then please do so because it's this is this week is kind of the week this this is the one that's going to make the difference to a lot of people um well, it's going to make a difference to the channel. And after this week, I will then start deciding what I think is going to be better overall for absolutely everything else. Right. I've got to keep pressing the button. I can't just um, press and hold like I can. It said I could with the gun. When I do the gun, it said that I would be able to just press and hold. Uh... Right, I got them there. I'm just looking now to see what this is. That's... Oh, that's a buff. Crit chance is increased right there with a buff. So we'll move that one round so I don't accidentally use it up. Uh, that is stamina buff. That is hit points. That one there is 35% maximum hit points. Stamina. Let's drop you into there. Right. What was that one? Health plus 170. Oh, did I do not enough? What is this? Restores 35%. Uh, maybe I should have left that one a little bit longer. Right. Jump dancer. The problem with these jump dancers is that they hit me behind. And then... Um, they, that's when they do the most damage. And then we get all of these guys as well. Let's take out this plier in for a minute. Then the shooter guy. There. Right. There's one. And then we can take out that masked fiend over there as well. The, the other shooter guy. Right. Oh. More of them. Yet more of them. That jump dancer there. He's got... To, I've, I've got to take... I've got to be careful. I, those seem to be the worst ones. Those jump dancers. If I get them down first. it seems to be the answer to this. There. Take those down. I've, I've got a lot of different stuff that I'm gathering. Like I am gathering up a, a huge amount of stuff. Look. All of these bits, I've got um, copper wires. I don't have any engines yet. There's a big chest up there, a valuable chest. So that might have the engine that we're after. I'm hoping. And hit points, yeah, we could do with eating a chicken risotto. That's 230, so I did waste some points last time. What do you got? Industrial engine. Yes! That's the one that we wanted. That is the single item that we wanted from in here. Now, we are also looking for the dog. Right, go this way. See if I can persuade the jump dancers and, and the rats to come over towards me over this way. Right, you're out. The jump dancer is there. Excellent. Right, because I don't want to go too much into the, the, the water over there. That's, that's, that's bad for me. So we want to do it kind of like this there. Going too much into the water is a bad thing. Plier imp right there. Okay. That one towards me right there. And then take him down fast. And then jump dancer. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wow. I took him out. Okay. I wasn't actually expecting to take him out. Across here and open. I got a valve. That may be useful. And in here I got a copper coil. Probably be useful. Right, now. Flyer in. Right, now see. Look, 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 look. I don't want to be in that water. So go over this way. Go around here like this. And then go back towards that mass fiend. Taking him down like that. And go to this guy. I want to go... If I go in that direction, every time I hit him, he's pushing straight back. That way, I'm avoiding the water and also I'm avoiding him, which should be a good thing. So I've got bandages. Those there, the dried apple slices. 
That's uh, additional... Yeah, well, actually, additional stamina is good. And then that... They restore 300 hit points, so I'm not going to use them yet. Let's hold on to those. Open you. We get another industrial... Nice. That's what we're talking about. Another industrial engine. There's two of those. We're on third floor. We've had 39 kills so far on here. Through we go. Into the next bit. Right, now, what do we got on this floor? Uh... There, bandy rat, take you out. Go, go, go. I, it's the, those those dancers. Get rid of that bandy rat first. Then we got these jump dancers, and they do a lot of damage. Right, they, when they first hit, they seem to do a huge amount of damage compared to some of the others. And that's the bit that I don't like. Oh, hang on. That's 300 points. So if I do that, there, and hit him hard like that there. I've got you in there. You're going to come out. Right, go to him there, like that, and then get that jump dancer. Get that jump dancer and take him down fast. There, right, he's out, and then avoid the, the shots if I can. Masked fiend. Have we got any more? Uh, no more came along, but there's only a small chest here. Let's hope it's better than that. One valve. A single solitary valve. Take any more valves. Right. But 607, I don't think I took any damage taking that lot out. And we can continue on our merry. Which means we go down to the... Uh, well, it's the fifth floor now, so this should be the final boss in here. Final boss. There he is. It's the same boss, but... Obviously, slightly different. Right. That is a big buff right there. Um, that is restores stamina. Restores 10% max stamina. You, a critical chance plus 35% lasts 180 seconds. Stamina, stamina. That restores a little bit of health. All right, I'll go to that one a minute. Let's first use... The roasted meat. Get my health right back up to max. Bubble fish stew. Do that. Iron sword. Right, now, I found last time that staying in close was the best way to do it. If I stayed in close, it's, it seemed to help the most. Um, because he, he does some of these nasty moves. Right, and then he's doing that. So I want to do that and then... Go straight back in. He is doing a lot of damage this time. Um, like that. Oops. Uh, five on there. And go again. See, it's, it's shooting thing that he does there. But I can keep doing this. Staying inside of that arc. This seems to work quite nicely there. Right, he's down to 20%. He's just done me a massive amount of damage then. Oops. I accidentally, I think, used two first aid slides. I did. I, I think I accidentally used two first aid things there because I didn't scroll through. But I did just get a ruined diver's hat. I got uh, another industrial engine. What did I pick up? What did I get? We, we got one of those because that's replaced the two that I just used. So I need more bandages now. Before I go to the next one, we've got three industrial engines. We've got some bandages. That's just plain loot. Ruined diver's hat. An essential item for a ruined diver. Ruined driver. Ruined diver. You can protect the head. Max hit points plus 235. But it doesn't have a lamp on the head. I love the extra hit points. I really do. That is absolutely amazing. But it doesn't have the light. That light is essential to us. Oh, hang on. But when we're in the actual ruins, is it... No, I think we can do that. I think we can have that while we're in the ruins. I think we're all right with that. Okay. That's actually quite cool it, um, that we've got both of those options. So we'll keep that one. Steel cable right there. Quarry. Uh, sulfate that we've got. We've got silicon chipset. i got one jet tube there. And so we've already got a spare jet tube now. I've got some more hit point stuff. Um, more there. Uh, that one's obviously the critical chance, which was 
quite amazed. That genuinely helped us, I believe. Okay, we've done everything that we can do in here. It's 47 kills that we got in here. We still haven't found the dog. I reckon we're going to have to go to the last level to find it. Dog. Exit. Right. Level 22 to 24. We'll have to do that in our next episode. We've cleared all of this. We will have to do level 22 to 24 in our next episode because we're not going to have time to do all of that today. Um, it would be quite cool if we could... But we won't have time for it. So we'll carry on this way. We're going to use the DD stop now, actually. Oh, what? This is the time of day when I want to use the DD stop. Because it's, like, quite late. So it's, it's, it's a handy time to do it. If I go chopping that tree down, I'm not going to be able to carry everything I get from it. So I'm going to leave the tree where it is. And we want to head home. Assemble the lift controls. I think I can do that now. With these three engines I've now picked up, I think I have everything I need to be able to assemble the lift controls. Which is absolutely magnificent. And wonderful and amazing and, and glorious. And making the fish stew, make, I need to make fish porridge. Fish porridge does not sound appealing. Haunted cave. Right. I need to do those two signs as well. That's, that's uh, two other things that I need to make. We will, we'll go back home and we'll have a look at the different... Actually, we've got like one hour... We've got a minute. We've essentially got a minute left. And given how long this episode has gone on, it's going to be too long if I do another day. See, this is what I mean. Um, cut it, doing this at 30 minutes... I wouldn't be able to do exact days if I sort of uh, if I cut it on almost precisely 30 minutes. I mean, maybe I could do one day an episode and you know, sort of work it like that. I, I I don't really know. It's um everything is up for debate at the moment. So bring in your suggestions, and then I can go through and sort of try to puzzle out what would be the single best option for this channel as a whole. Uh, anyway, if you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.